Okay, guys, so these are the bromeliads. And um, this is the kind that I have. This is the kind that I have. Isn't that pretty? It's already blooming some kind of purple thing pushing up in the middle there. So yeah, they came on like um, long like sticks and they're all joined up so I just cut them and separated, separated them. Um, I only have two that are blooming in the middle. The rest, I'm assuming they were pups and yeah. So I'm going to just go ahead and show you how I'm going to pop them. Thanks for watching. Okay, so in here, as you could see earlier, that I took some compost from the barrel. And I also mixed it up with um, some of the native sandy Florida soil because I don't want this to be so thick I need it to be like loose soil so I'm gonna go ahead and put that in and just cover it up fill it up I'm just gonna basically just have these nice and sitting somewhere that it doesn't take much sun because the location that I got it from it looked like it got like um, morning sun and then the rest of it is like shaded with three trees because Bermuda some some version doesn't like full sun so I'm just gonna go ahead and Continue the tradition with these kind because the colors are really really pretty and I don't want to put it in full sunlight to burn the, the leaves so for these I have a nice um, like semi shaded area like morning um, sun and then in the afternoon the sun goes away so I think that would be a good location for these look how pretty that is that's really pretty so I'm just sitting that down in there and then I'm just covering up the the little root areas because they, they do have some little roots that they need to hold on to anyways so Sorry for the wind guys, it's kind of windy today, but it's pretty hot. I think it's like maybe like in the 80s. It's, it's, it's really hot, but I'm happy to see a little bit of wind. So these were one of the pups and as you can see it has like some little root like structures so I'm just basically putting the soil up to this area right here sticks from my <laughs> from my compost
So guys, I ordered a camera and I'm waiting for it to be delivered. So hopefully I can start showing more quality videos because right now I'm using my mom's phone because for some reason my, whenever I started start recording on mine, it just cuts off. I guess my memory is a bit loaded on my phone. So yeah guys, I'll be getting a camera so I can have the luxury of taking that around in the yard with me. As you can see guys the soil is really loose I didn't want it to be so cakey because these guys they can actually grow without roots because these they weren't even on in any um, underground they were actually like coming through my neighbor's fence and I just went ahead and snipped them off so yeah these guys they can you can put them up on a tree with like some coconut core and tie them on they have a wording for it i can't remember and yeah they can survive on the sides of trees and stuff like that they don't necessarily need soil but i'm gonna go ahead and start these off at soil so when it when it starts to give me um pops maybe i could start doing like a tree kind of design eventually but i just wanted um these are my first batch so i'm just gonna plant these in the soil so i can get multiple from it. So I'll go ahead and pack that soil. And these, I don't think I'm going to water them because when I when I picked them up they had they were filled with water. Maybe I might just go ahead and fill them up with a little water and yeah leave them out into the area that has the semi shade so i got one more to go Hey guys so see it's pretty firm down in there because I'm also pressing down on the soil so it stays firm and not wobbly so there you go I'm gonna go ahead and put these off to the side until I'm ready to plant them in the ground because the garden that I'm gonna do I need to paint and then put some different soil into that area but I'll, I'll take you guys along with the process so yeah guys These are the these are the moms so hopefully they'll probably push out some more pups since they're blooming I don't know if these when they bloom if they die eventually but hopefully um, they could promote some pups so I can multiply this um, this kind
Okay na guys. So I got five. Five bromeliads. They are so pretty. I love the color. And I, I'm I'm wait uh, I can't wait to see the the full bloom of these moms. And as you can see the pups they're still young, it's just bare on the inside. So yeah guys, um thanks again. Thanks for watching and there will be more videos to come, a lot more to come. Bye.